I'm back. Hello, Blobbies. It's me, Melissa, your friendly neighborhood circulation assistant from the Phoenixville Public Library. And I'm here to tell you why I'd like to be Miss Blobfest this year, or better yet, Miss Blobfest Universe. As you know, I love B-movies and horror movies, as well as scary stories. But what have I been up to since last Blobfest, you may ask? Well, I actually ran a program at the library for the patrons talking about different horror movies and scary stories that they could read while enjoying the Halloween spook season. I find my job at the library gives me plenty of opportunities to share my love of horror and all things spooky, even with kids. Whether it's in children's circulation or upstairs with adults, I pride myself on finding just the right things for each patron who comes into the library. Even on my busiest days at work, I find myself thinking about Bob Fest and daydreaming about winning that Miss Blobfest crown. One of the more exciting things to happen to me since last Blobfest was getting to volunteer at one of my favorite places on the planet, the Colonial Theater. I was invited to join the Fright Night and Cult Film Committee, which means I get to curate, host, and introduce movies that are super cool, including house this was my first movie that i introduced on stage at the colonial back in january and it was a blast since then i've been able to make videos during quarantine to introduce movies that we watched together my favorite introduction was playing jan in the pan for the brain that wouldn't die i've spent a lot of time during quarantine watching crazy movies online not just with my friends from the colonial but also with Mr. Lobo and Sinsomniacs from Standing in the Insomnia. And most recently, I became the heir to the chair from Mr. Lobo's rocking chair. She's going to have a special place of honor right here in my living room. I think I may have been going through withdrawals from the Colonial during quarantine because I started fighting make-believe monsters like the heroes in some of my favorite movies. Maybe my imaginary fighting skills aren't as good as I'd like to think they are. But I'd like to think that I could still do some amazing things even if I'm not like some big tough Amazon. For instance. So here I am, Blobbies, ready to serve Phoenixville and beyond as Miss Blobfest Universe 2020.